We'll stick with Montreal, who sends Arturi Lekin into the Colorado Avalanche. Uh, Chad, you mentioned him a second ago. And uh, Montreal, again, uh, great return for Lekkonen. They get Justin Barron, the defenseman from the Halifax Mooseheads in the queue, and a second round pick in 2024. I'm going to give them an A- minus on this one, simply because Lekkonen fit in so well there. He played very well with uh, Gallagher, and I think he's going to be missed there. But it, because of the state of Montreal, I think this trade makes a lot of sense. Justin Barron, that's a pretty great pickup. He's putting up some decent points in the AHL as a defenseman, and picking out that second-round pick is no slouch, even though it's ages away from now, it feels like. And then Colorado, I'll, I'll have to give him a B-plus here. <sighs> They've got a lot of options on defense, so trading away one wasn't the end of the world for them. And uh, Lekkonen's going to fit in well in that bottom six. And like I said, if you pair him with the right guys, he can actually pop off. So I think it's a good pickup as well. Definitely. A lot of offensive upside for Arturi Lekkonen. I'm giving both teams an A-plus for this one, guys, because for Montreal, like you mentioned, Case, like such a great return. Even though that pick is two years from now, you get a guy, Justin Barron, who sort of fits their timeline now, and Arturi Lekkonen doesn't commit to the rebuild kent hughes is doing that and uh you know i love it so a plus for the habs also a plus for colorado because you know what was the one thing we talked about in our uh last episode before this our central division rankings it was about you know colorado and our question marks about their bottom six well i think after today guys their bottom six is looking pretty damn fine and our turdy lekkonen as sort of a middle six player if you will uh, i think fits in really well Gotta be excited.